And to news on that suspected serial killer under arrest in Stockton, California, wanted for at least six murders. Police say he was taken into custody while, quote, out hunting his next victim. And the chief now saying, we are sure we stopped another killing. Here's ABC's Mona Kosar Abdi tonight. Tonight, police in Stockton, California, say they have taken a suspected serial killer off the streets that terrorized the community. At this time, we have the right person in custody. Police say they zeroed in on 43-year-old Wesley Brownlee through community tips, making the arrest early Saturday morning, as they say he was lurking around dark areas looking to kill again. Brownlee allegedly armed with a gun. He was on a mission to kill. He was out hunting. According to authorities, Brownlee is linked to the murders of five men in Stockton, one in Oakland. They also believe he shot a woman in April of 2021 who survived. This person was near perfect, you know, didn't make many mistakes, you know, you purposely stayed in the dark. Police say ballistics tests and surveillance video have linked the seven crime scenes, but that recovered gun is still being tested. Have you guys been able to link that gun to any of the murders that occurred in Stockton or in Oakland? That's part of the ongoing investigation. Uh, the ATF has been a great partner for us. They're handling all the ballistic evidence and we hope to hear more from them soon. The police chief says he believes the man in this video with the distinctive walk is Brownlee. And tonight, the mother of Paul Yaw, one of the victims, grateful a suspect is now in custody. To get this person off the street really means a lot. And the San Joaquin County District Attorney says initial charges will be filed tomorrow when the suspect is arraigned in court. David? Right. Mona Kosar Abdi with us again tonight. Mona, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.